On this episode of Ask Future P, I tell you guys what I wanted to be when I was younger. I spill some details on my next short film, and I announce the winner of the iTunes gift card that I was giving away earlier this month. If you have a question or just something to say, just ask me, Trippy, and I'll answer away. All you have to do is ask me, Trippy. What's up, guys? So let's dive right into the questions. The first question comes from Thomas Belly, and he wants to know if I'm religious, and if so, which religion and how much. I am religious, and I classify myself as a Christian, but how much? It's really hard to say how much exactly, but what I can say is that I am not super duper religious. I'm not one of those people that's always like, oh my god, praise the Lord, he's my savior, oh my god, thank you, thank you. I am religious, but not super duper religious, if that makes sense. I think it does. Thomas Valley also wants to know if I'd rather have 1 million inactive subscribers and be making money from YouTube, or have 1k active subscribers. This is an easy would you rather question. I would rather have 1k active subscribers. The reason is I just love interacting with people. I love interacting with you guys. The main reason why I started my YouTube channel was because I was at a low point in my life and I didn't have friends and I just want, I needed a way to express myself and have people to talk to. And so making money from YouTube is nice but it's not what makes me the happiest. What makes me happiest is just you guys. Liking my videos, helping me to improve my videos, commenting on my videos, me being able to reply to your comments and have some sort of a conversation. Overall, what makes me happiest is being able to connect with people around the world that I just never dreamt of ever being able to connect with. Molly Durden wants to know if I prefer Allie Trippy or the new Allie. As much as I loved Allie Trippy, I have to say I prefer the new Allie. The reason is, and this might sound a little bit weird, but her personality is a lot like mine. She's quirky, she's funny, and, well, except for the outgoing part. <laughs> but she, her personality is pretty much like mine, and I just feel like I can really connect with her. I hopefully can meet Charles in the new alley someday, and uh, yeah, so like I said, I prefer the new alley. Molly Durden also wants to know what did I want to be when I was younger. When I was young, I really wanted to be a teacher. So much so that, you know how when you're younger, you like to do some role playing and whatnot. I would literally hold classes. I would teach a class in my room for no one. There would be no one. It would just be me talking to the wall. And I just enjoyed that. And then I got to middle school and I was like, you know what, f that. Why would I come back here? Because I hate school now. Or maybe it was because that was more of a role playing thing. I really don't know what it was, but I just wanted to be a teacher. And another thing that I wanted to be was a librarian for some reason. I mean, it's not a good paying job and it's pretty boring. I don't know how I would be able to handle being quiet for that long. Quiet and boring in here. Aw, oh, who's ready to read some books? You can check them out, but make sure to bring them back. What? Be quiet. You're in a library. No, I'm not going to be quiet. You know why? Because this place is boring as heck, it smells like old people, and it's so quiet you can hear people fart. Sorry. That's okay. See what I'm talking about? Now, who's ready to get turned up? Oh yeah, we getting turned up! Woo! Yeah, I'd be fired on the first day. And last but not least, Molly Durden also wants to know what's the next short short film about. I obviously don't want to spill too much about the next short short film, which by the way, I am now calling them short films. Surprise! Alright, so, but basically what I can tell you is that it's about two friends who go and investigate a haunted basement. Oh, and remember a few episodes ago when I told you guys I really don't know when the next short film is going to be up? Well, now I know there is a projected and hopeful date. I hopefully will have the next short film done. Uh, October 30th is the date. So hopefully everything will be done and then in the weeks leading up to October 30th, I will release a video with the trailer. Alright, so now you know what time it is. It's time to announce the winner of the iTunes gift card! Woo! I don't know what that was. Anyway. So, drumroll please. <laughs> I was gonna do a drum roll, but yeah, it turned out to be a disaster. Anyway, never mind, no drum roll! The winner is. Mm hmm. Molly Durden. <laughs> Woo! Throw party! Holla! What's going on? I don't even know. I'm a little crazy today. Uh, so, I don't have the iTunes gift card yet. I usually buy it the week of announcing the winner because I know if I buy it ahead of time, 
I will just get tempted and use it. So, but I, I didn't really get a chance to go to the store yet, so you're gonna have to wait a couple of days. Sorry about that, Molly Jordan. I'm sorry. But uh, I will eventually get it to you. It's not like I'm not going to get it to you. You're just gonna have to wait a little bit. It's not gonna be like a week later and then I finally give it to you. As soon as I have a chance to get to the store, I'm gonna get it and then send it to you. And I'm gonna send it to you via your YouTube inbox, so make sure to check that. Alright, so that's all I have for this episode of Ask Future Free, so please leave me your questions in the comments below and I'll be sure to answer them on a future episode of Ask Future Free. If you smiled while watching this video, please give this video a thumbs up down below. Also down below is a subscribe button, click it now. I upload awesome content like this every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, so subscribe now to avoid missing out. Alright, so I'm Patrick Trippy, thanks for the wonderful questions, I love you guys, and as always, thanks for watching.